YouTube, what is up, guys? It's my my Friday up update video where I just tell you in on some things. And I'm actually, I got, I got some things to tell you, uh, or at least something in the revive world that you should know. Uh, but I've, I've got a, my little list here, and I'm gonna just bang this out in one take. So bear with me. Um, also, somebody, I, somebody last week, I saw a comment. And we're like, hey, man, this is just. I can't wait till you're back to the normal things, and when you have do normal videos. Well, the Friday and Thursday videos are like the live stream on, on Thursday, and and the update video on Friday, um, they're just bonus things. Like, I never used to upload. So, like, the other slots, you're going to get, like, fuller, more pointful videos. But this Friday, it's just a chance for me to talk to you guys, tell you how I'm doing, and uh, just some changes and all the things that, that are happening in my life and companies and all that. So, that being said, let's talk. Oh, my gosh, I'm skating again. I skated yesterday for a video that comes out tomorrow, and I and it felt good. And I skated today, and I didn't successfully do what I meant was what I was trying to do. But it, but it feels good. My feet are back to normal, so I'm going to be hopefully skating five or six days a week again. Uh, it's been a, a long week of not skateboarding, um, and I'm happy to be able to say that. I'm back. Uh, <laughs> so uh, with the Revive, so this is some good news and bad news. The good news is that you guys have definitely wanted skateboards in this time of craziness that we're, that we're experiencing right now in the world. Um, and we have been able to give you those boards, but we're we're selling out. Like the the options are getting slimmer, and uh, the board order is going slower because the whole world is going slower. So there might come a time where we have a, like a, there's like a week or two of we, we just don't have skateboards. So what we're gonna do to hopefully get this in time before we sell out, we actually uh, have some blasts from the past graphics coming out. We were able to make this happen. And um, some graphics that you haven't seen for a long time are going to be making a comeback. And that's very exciting. Uh, I'm going to keep you – I do these every single week, so I'll be able to keep you guys updated. Uh, but right now, uh, if you want a skateboard, go get it <laughs> because um, it is getting slim pickings. But we're going to do what we can. And we'll, of course, keep you with content and entertained and whatnot. But um, I, I really hope the summer order gets here on time because their graphics are just – to they're so good. JP Coover, if you're watching this – smile because you crushed it uh so that's that um and next friday i'll have more to say on that um i'll have a better idea uh but entertainment wise i'm still playing animal crossing and final fantasy 7 like a maniac but one of my favorite tv 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 shows of all time are they came back they like haven't been making the they like stopped the series the, the series finale was over and now they're coming back to do one more episode that they filmed at their houses and they're going to put it all together and that's Parks and Rec. If you are an Office or Parks and Rec fan or both or if, if you're an Office fan and you didn't know about Parks and Rec, watch the whole series, you're welcome. Um but it's like that it, it, they're they're kind of similar. They're not in the same world or anything, but you'll enjoy it. Uh Parks and Rec, especially from the second season till the end is just perfect. It's so good. Um and the fact that they're coming together made my night last night. My face smiled and it's been smiling ever since. Okay, maybe not, but it's, uh, it makes me very happy, so that's cool, and I wanted to tell you guys about that. Uh, during this quarantine time, I try to keep you guys informed of the good things. we gotta, we got to concentrate on the good things. Um, and lastly, I've got an embarrassing story I actually remembered, and this is gross. I don't know if I should be telling this on the internet, um, but it's just a story, so it's just for your ears, okay? I was running into the grocery store years ago. This is like five years ago, six years ago. Actually, it's probably like seven years ago, okay? Not that it matters, all right? Not that... The number that I'm saying really matters, but it, this is what it was. I was at the grocery store running in, and it was one of those things where the wife was like, waiting in the car. So, you know, I'm just going to get one thing, grab it, and get out. And I slipped. And I was like, whoa, that's not like something slippery on the ground. And it got in my arm and on like my shirt or something or my, my pants. And I looked down and I was like, oh, who spilled pasta here? Like, I immediately was like, this is gross. I'm in pasta. And uh, I was like, it's the grocery store. Like, like it could have been some, I don't know, I, like a jar of pasta sauce. I, I don't know. But I, I went to their bathroom, and I cleaned up. And I got outside, and my wife's like, what took you so long? And I was like, well, if, it's, if I smell like, uh, like hand soap, like generic lemon-scented hand soap, I don't know what they had, or a potpourri hand soap, it's because I slipped and fell in pasta. And then I just moved on in life. And ever since then, I've looked back, and I was like, I don't think that was pasta. I think someone threw up right there, and I just so happened to be the dude that walked into it. And it's gross. And I'm glad that, like, when it happened, my brain was just like, Andy, this is disgusting. Just tell yourself it's pasta and go on with life. And that, that was a great way to deal with my problems at the time because that was a problem, cleaning myself off in the Kroger bathroom. Boy, it was embarrassing. Luckily, not many people were in the store, and no one actually saw it. 
But I, I wish like one of my friends would have been happened to be there and been like looked over like Andy just slipped in that throw up and that's very embarrassing. No one saw it, but I'm coming clean now. You know. Uh, <laughs> all right, that is my update video. Um, I tomorrow I have a fun little like kind of like a day in the life, but it's like a vlog episode. Technically, it's not like the full day. Uh, very fun. I do some cool things uh, here at the house. That's and I start skateboarding again. And then uh, on Sunday, I have a how to ollie video uh, that kind of that teaches you how to ollie, but then it kind of gives you some helpers if you're learning at home because a lot of us are just hanging out at home right now. So um, next week, we've got a bunch of fun videos. If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Um, if you need skateboarding gear, shredcourse.com. We're running low. There's your warning. And that is it. Thank you guys so much uh, for all the nice things, love, and support you guys show me. Um, I am so fortunate that I can, I can just come home and I can do my job from my house. And, uh, I just want to say thank you. I hope you guys are finding a good way to pass this time and, and make this time like a, a, a positive in, in your situation, a positive more than a negative, uh, stay positive, stay healthy, stay happy, stay home, stay. I'm really, I need to stop saying the stay thing at the end of the video. I'm done. Six minutes. It was good hanging out with you. Oh, oh I'm, I'm slipping. Oh yeah. And toast. I tried to get toast to be in the video. He's in the thumbnail. He's not. So. Just go out, look at the thumbnail. You can see the dog's butt in my reflection in the thumbnail. There you go. Somebody's going to go look now.